name is Dave Schaefer and this is uh, February 5th, 2023 and this is the Diagnosing and Treating Somatic Dysfunction um, using OAB. This is Bailey. He's going to be our participant. So I'm going to check out <coughs> back here. And he's got Really good range of motion on this side. We'll jump over here. <clears throat> I'll check his range of motion here. Right away I can tell that he's blocking me. He's braced right up and not wanting to move that at all. So I'm going to go up here to his neck. <clears throat> Check a couple vertebrae this way, which if this is a type one somatic dysfunction, this way should be good. <clears throat> I'll step back over here and I'll check this side. <clears throat> Starting up at his atlas. And this side is not. He's braced up on this as well. So I will treat that. I'm gonna jump back up over on this side and we'll try to <clears throat> treat this a little bit. We'll start here. And on the back of his, we'll start on his upper lumbar, his lower thoracic. We'll start getting this there we go. We'll just ease those into a side bend. Try to encourage that. Get in time with his spine there. We'll go again. It's gonna take a little bit of finesse here, something we don't want to force. There we go, there we go. But just opening and closing those facets will, there we go, allow them to work properly. There. Now, jump back over here. Remembering how it felt on the off side, we'll see what this near side feels like. Now they're very similar. So we'll go up to his cervical. We'll start at the, that's, drastically better already, just fixing his <clears throat> thoracic vertebrae. Keep coming across from his joint we're working on. <clears throat> Let's start back up here. I'm gonna move up across from his atlas. Go down to his axis. Nice. We'll move down to C3 and four. Hang in there, partner. Got a little too tight. We'll move down. There we go. <laughs> I will jump over. Check the other side real quick. Stay on that side. There. Good. Now from this side we'll now that's much better. We have he's not braced up against me keeping his back in an arc like before. He was wanting to keep his back arc this way, fighting that movement. Now he's very 
willing and he should be more balanced for the ride. Thank you. <laughs>